Okay, we're in, boys. Bosco! Free anti-mind control helmets for the first 50 lunatics to come out of hiding! I've been telling you, little pals, he's just plain vanished. We'd better look around the joint for clues. Good plan, Sammo. Guess that's why they call you guys in for the brainy stuff, and leave the senseless violence to the likes of me. I deeply resent that comment, Mr. Paper. Yeah, Flint. We're gonna have to join together and use every detective skill we know to find Bosco. Well, that's a no-go. Any more ideas? Hmm, let me think. Good morning, YouTube. Your boy Pacifist here, bringing you another uh, episode of Simon Max. Hope you're doing well. I know it's been a while since I've released another video of uh, Simon Max, so I'm here again with another one. I'm gonna try and finish this through this week. Wait, today's Thursday. Oh, it's possible. Possible. Yeah, I can finish this uh, this game series, uh, season two, this week, and hopefully uh, it will be all be uploaded by the end of this week. So I'm in here again. Uh, yeah. So we're looking for Bosco. Uh, I think Bosco ran away because of uh, what we what happened in uh, was it the previous episode or the episode before? It was. Yeah, it was the previous. Yeah, it was the previous episode, right? Because we. We got them. I can't remember who them was. We said it was out. Oh man, I can't remember. But yeah, I remember Bosco was running away. So yeah, okay. Well, uh, let's see what to do. Let's I've always Bosco wondered Bosco. what Bosco keeps hidden back here. I've always wondered if he's wearing pants back there. <laughs> Actually, what is that you? My head. It's Bosco's my first moai head toy. Oh, what's, what was that? Stuff. Wow, it's everything we needed to solve last year's hypnotism conspiracy. Whew, I'd kill for a time machine right about now. Of course, I'd kill for just about Dying anything. Point. This keypad must control the laser grid blocking Bosco's bathroom. Oh, use it to spell boobies. I love that. Bosco, lasers, and pushing random buttons are three things that don't go well together, little buddy. Yeah, I agree with it. What's that say? It message. says the code is in my head. We better find it soon then. It must be getting lonely. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think the code's free to two anyway. But okay. I know system. Well, I can't use it. Weenie. Bosco? No, different weenie. <laughs> Magazine. As informative as Max Impeachment Weekly is, I doubt it'll tell us where Bosco is. Bosco didn't take any pictures of himself. His camera no doubt thanks him. Okay. Camera. Garbage can. No Bosco's in here. We already checked the roof. Just a pigeon AA meeting. Nothing worth mentioning. AA meeting, huh? Bosco, you in there? I hope not. Or Bosco be gone. Our lust for this tangy fruit drink started this whole mess. No clues here. Just an enlarger. No big thing. It shows you what's inside what's inside. Are T-H-E-M really out there? Ah! Any clues for us, Hugh Bliss? Nope, not a clue. All that paranoia. And he couldn't even save himself. No clues here. Hey, Sizemo, what's shaking? That's a laser thing. The freezer's Bosco free. The freezer's Bosco free. A painful reminder of the Bosco shaped hole in our hearts. We can't get in until we get past this laser grid. To get past the laser grid, first you have to forgive the laser grid.
do what Nothing you say. Nothing doing. Okay, okay. We're x ray All right. Let's have a look at your x-ray, Mr. Moaihead. Oh, I kind of We'll see what's causing that persistent tinnitus. Prognosis, Sam? Either this toy has a tumor the size of an overfed cat, or it's too dark to read it. Okay, so we're going to x-ray. No way. Uh, somewhere with light. I guess they know Where would I be able... Wait, wasn't there a thing on the top of the thing? Up there. That's where we scanned hmm. for the, uh, toy like... for the Christmas one. Say it? It looks like Bosco's as clever as Boobie. you are at cutting edge intellectual humor. <laughs> you gotta admit, that is pretty funny. Okay, I can then remember the code. It's um... the x-ray I took of Bosco's Moai head. A piece of paper inside says 531-8008. I'm going to write this down just in case. So 531. 531-8008. Okay. I write down the piece of paper just in case. I'm sure he'll just type it in himself, but we'll see. All oh, right, he did have himself. <laughs> so, right. You. Waste of time writing it down on a piece of paper. Let's check okay. in the bathroom for more clues. The bathroom we go. This is the bathroom. Let's see if there's anything in the bathroom to tell us where Bosco's top secret bunker is. Oh, so that's or maybe cooking. the bathroom oh, is his top secret bunker. Gosh. This is exactly where I'd want to spend an apocalypse. I sense that something terrible happened here. Ho ho, you don't know the half of it. Oh my gosh. Bosco's been ordering nothing but baking soda and paper mache. Bosco has all his shirts specially treated to block out the thought control rays. Lest nefarious forces take control of his nipples. What's this? What's behind you? Hot toilet wine. Oh, Everything what? Bosco would uh, need to survive for months. Wendell. Hmm. A nice aged bottle of Nippy Valley. There's Woof. one rouge. Nippy Valley Woof. Or party time or any time. Some idiot left the cork out, Max. It turned to vinegar. What? Vinegar? Oh, wine. From the looks of it, these wine bottles haven't been touched in decades. Maturing the fruit. I'm pretty sure I can hold it until the end of the case. Pretty sure. Are you sure? It might take me qu quite a few hours, sir. It's empty. It is me playing. Biotech. A Bosco Tech Drain Liberator a 6000. Bosco. I'm, biotech. I'm not going anywhere <clears throat> near that thing. Not after seeing what it did to that sludgy delivery guy. The sound alone still haunts my nightmares. urinals. Such a crude and barbaric means of bladder relief. Says the guy who uses the fire hydrant. If we explode it, they will come. I okay. would clean up in here, but I don't want to disturb any evidence. Ah, uh, yes. But which one was this one? Disguises. I remember the English one, the French one, the, the Russian one, the, 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 the mama one. I don't remember this last one. Do you guys remember Bosco's that? disguises. Each more offensively ludicrous than the last. Was it the last episode? It probably was the last episode, but I really can't remember. I remember these four, because these four was funny. I can't remember the last one. Bosco's high-tech, 100% convincing disguise kit. So, which kit was he using last year, then? A jumbo-sized bag of cotton balls. D don't open it, Sam! I can never eat just one! What, face? A marshmallow, son. Bosco keeps plenty of baking soda on hand to keep the bathroom fresh. It's an industrial sized barrel of baking soda. I, every Tons time I, I think of baking soda, like I, I, I remember that one. song. It's like the, Bosco was obsessed with the, with the shape. Cocoa. Like I'm obsessed oh, with the oh, shape sorry, of Bosco's remember. unnaturally baking bulbous soda. forearms? A little like that, but slightly less creepy. What the hell? Not enough beer. Not big enough. Oh, not big enough. Bigger. Oh, really. Ugh, sheesh. Even bathrooms aren't safe from natural male enhancement spam. 
Oh, Rampaging Roy Neary with a meat and That's two why he's soda. Recognize that from Easter Island, Max? It's a model volcano. I'd say it's downright exemplary. There's no way I'm touching that towel. Not after all the people who've been using it. But Bosco and I are the only ones who ever come back here. Exactly. <laughs> and that kid, what's his name? Weepers. The one that pisses a lot from the sodium office. Okay, uh, this should, no. Is that, ooh, is there anything else to do? Hmm. Maybe we can pour vinegar on baking soda. You know how it, you know how it goes. Or we can pour anything, would it, would it, would it erupt? <laughs> No? It's a model volcano. Okay. What are we... Oh, we've got poor baking soda in first story. It's like I'm always telling you, Sam. We need a much bigger explosion. This time, you might be right, Max. Oh, just wasted baking soda there. Oh, took more baking soda. Can I just... There's not enough baking soda left to do any good. Hmm. There's not enough baking soda. We make some more baking soda. What was that for, Sam? That barrel was looking at me funny. Oh, 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 oh guys. You guys know what I'm gonna do now, right? <laughs> Sabotage! Let's go! Oh, 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 stand back. That was and so the cool. school board said our cases had no educational merit. Do it again! Do it again! What's that noise? UFO. Them. T H E M. Oh, beat me up, Scotty. They've come for us, Max. It's T H E M. Good. About time we found out who's responsible for this travesty. Wow. The bus bill wasn't smoking, so he was actually being honest. I actually don't know what this episode called, you know? It was called... Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Time for shooting practice, you know? It's been a while since I shot things. Practice my U UPA. Work up as well, so you know, got practice. It's a typical wake up early, record early, so I could try and upload it as soon as possible for you guys. Hey guys! Oscar's a cat! <laughs> Look, I can explain. Did you get a haircut, Bosco? There's something different. Finally see a doctor about that, uh, personal problem? You guys done? Yeah, that's all we got. Good. Now shut up and help me! What seems to be the problem, Bessie? That, that elevator over there! It's horrible! I went inside looking for T-H-E-M, but when I got out, I saw my mother! Yes! It gets worse. I ran out of there fast as I could, and when I came out, I was like this. You gotta fix it, guys. I was gonna do a joke, say a joke, same time until we were milking it, but okay, yeah, well, um, well, well, just in case, you know, people will be like cringing and stuff. What are you doing on an alien spaceship? I got tired of being scared of T-H-E-M. I finally said, bring them on. I built this device that let me predict where they were gonna show up next, then I let him come on and take me. So, did you get udders, or are you a boy cow? That's none of our business, Max. What happened <laughs> next, boy cow, you know, I used the device on myself, you know, to test it. After that, it's all a blur. Where's this THEM detector device you were talking about? I don't know. I must have lost it in that elevator after I got turned into this, 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 this thing. I wonder if we go in there, will we turn the human rather than that? Like that Where's animal? this THEM detector device you were talking oh, about? Oh crap, I kicked him I don't know. I must have lost it in that elevator after I got turned into this, 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 this thing. Where are we? What is this place, Bosco? 
You guys still don't get it? This is it! The center of the entire operation of T-H-E-L! Kinda sparse for the headquarters of a sinister cabal bent on world domination. You don't need much room when you can go anywhere you want through time and space. The place seems pretty empty. Where are T-H-E-Y hanging out? I don't know, but you can bet they're around here somewhere. Just waiting to probe us and turn us all into freakish animal-human hybrids. Bosco, Sam is standing right here. <laughs> What's with all the volcanoes back in your store? Yeah, guys, clean. guys, try to keep up. Haven't you figured anything out yet? The volcano is what summons the spaceship, fools. Sam, is it my imagination, or are we being scolded by the guy who's half cow? Don't go anywhere, Bosco. Now where am I gonna go looking like this? Help me get back to normal, guys. Normal? <laughs> we'll get you back the way you were before, but uh, we're not promising more than that. Hmm. Appears to be made of the finest leather from only the finest in mutilated cattle. Don't joke about that! <laughs> that's it. That's it hey Max, what do you think this thing is? Calibrating. Complete. I now have mastered your primitive but no less valid language. <coughs> Please choose from the following topics of conversation. Oh, what the heck is this? Um, this is my location? Who are you? I am this crass artificial intelligence. I supervise the operations of this craft and the activities of its crew. Where's the crew? They are currently occupied with the craft's primary mission. They will arrive shortly to detain you for your own safety. For my own safety? What happened to Bosco? The intruder made unsanctioned use of the time shuttle. How do we use that elevator? Simply choose a destination. Additional destinations can be opened using convenient pre-printed time cards. Pre-printed time cards? Okay, system stuff. What are my options? My personality can be configured to respond in the style most appropriate to the user. Please choose from the following options. Politically correct, suggestive, abusive, passive-aggressive. Okay, we're gonna be abusive because you know... Abusive? Good choice, moron. I want them to be did you come up with that yourself, or did your idiot friend help out? To make it for the for, for the lols. So this is abusive now. What's a print time card? Why We'd like there? to get a time card, please. I cannot print a time card until the captain chooses a destination. That wasn't abusive. Okay, let's terminate. So long. Get lost. Okay. Failure. Ooh. Okay. See, I oh, clicked outside. Uh, I would have said the uh, bushing gone wrong, but okay. Speaker device. Looks like some kind of weird alien radio. I see a button. It's I press the a button. elevator's emergency recall button. It is emergency. The spaceship's artificial intelligence unit is stuck on the elevator. The HDMI. Can I go in the elevator? Oh, home HDMI. I can't even read. <laughs> We're already there. Let's take this. That time card thing, and we're in we go. Bosco's again? How'd we end up back here? Judging from the lack of safety railings and ready availability of Baby guns and ammo, I'd heck? say we've gone back in time. Seems to be some time in the early that Bosco's mole. Bosco's mom. You fools gonna buy something, or do you want to make a baby? Oh, make yeah. a baby. <laughs> make a baby, she said. Modify carbon data. Oh, isn't that what Sybil's hey, thing? Max, remember that old carbon data we got from Sybil last yeah. year? Yeah, we gave it to Bosco so he could keep scanning his weenies. Looks like he's made some uh, modifications to it. All right, cool. We got that now. <clears throat> Done. They're... They're... They're beautiful. Revolver, Whee! Deagles, M... 14 or M16, I can't remember. Uh, baby needs. Baby food and bum wipes. If you use less of one, you wouldn't need as many of the other. 
too much. What a waste. What a senseless waste. <laughs> chemical hmm, sampling. What's this? It's my chemical sampling. Get somebody to spit on it, and it gives you a sample test tube for the baby maker. Mind if we borrow it? Go ahead. I already got all I need. Baby making looks machine. Looks like a weird bread making machine. Don't be silly. That's my baby maker. You take a spit sample from the mother and one from the father, mix them together in that machine, and then out comes a happy little bundle of perfection. Finally, somebody explains how that works. <laughs> That's not the generally agreed upon method, Max. Okay, uh, I guess I should have popped up. Regarding the rabbit, there's like a peace sign now. A peace logo. Three peace. Oh, there's wine bottles and stuff are still here. So it's been mm, here since a nice she was aged around. bottle of Nippy Valley brand vinegar. Ah, oh, some idiot left the cork in, Sam. It's still wine. Oh, so we're doing here. Breathe for a few decades, Max. Okay. Okay. I'm still fairly sure I can hold it. You sure? Last chance, Sam. Okay. Russians send first woman into space. Soon they'll send all their women into space. <laughs> a bit controversial, but okay. Hmm. You right now? No timeout needed. We're better to crunch numbers than in the john. We're better to crunch crap. numbers than in the john. Yeah, I don't have to skip this. Baseball pulls is the game. My paws are spotless. Oh, the germs look so young. Yeah, yeah. I don't think we can do it. Big ammo. Okay. Let's leave it. Okay. Uh, let's check the freezer. Cold orange things you suck never go out of style. Milk and hooch. Something for the kitties and something for your cereal. In the, garbage. the one constant across all human cultures of all times is a massive amount of waste. Okay. Oh, there's a thing you even took the elevator. Okay. Let me see something. Uh, just we've got this comment here. Let me scan her. It printed a time card with a presidential seal and some strange numbers. What was that? We just needed to scan you for... Uh... The hell you did! Explain yourselves! You must be Mrs. Bosco. That's Mrs. I didn't even Bosco. Her. I don't want any part of your oppressive patriarchy. Fair enough, oh, man. Gosh. Miss. Oppressive you? patriarchy. Who are you? Um, Sam and Max, right. freelance police. We're hearing Finally, that a lot the this year. Maybe you can help me catch that fool. I'm gonna go down that road. Which fool did you want us to catch exactly? That that man who just came in here yelling about conspiracies and busting up the place. Bosco always did know how to make a memorable first impression. Can you tell us more about the man who trashed your shop? He took one look at me and screamed. Ah. That should narrow the list of suspects down to any man with eyes. Then he stumbled back Mexican. and ran right into my baby maker. Ouch. We can't take the case, but we'll keep an eye out for your vandal, Miss Bosco. I swear if I ever find him, I'm going to make sure he gets no pleasure in this life. Oh, Typical I haven't thing. heard a tale of motherly love like that since the Manchurian candidate. Uh, I didn't want We're here to help your son. I don't have a son. You think it's not enough I'm a businesswoman and inventor? A woman's only useful if she's got a son. It's not that. We're friends with him. Well, acquaintances. We know him. We've spoken to him more than once. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm not defined by my children. But when I do have one, she's gonna be the most perfect little angel. What was that you said about making a baby? I'm made uncomfortable by this line of questioning, Sam. That's just because you're scared of a world where career-minded women don't need to be tied to a man to have a family. This ain't the past anymore. It's the 1960s. 
They can talk about putting a person on the moon, and I can invent a baby-making machine. Well, how does this baby-making machine work? You just take a DNA sample from the mother and the other person and combine them in that machine. Let it bake a couple hours and you've got a beautiful baby girl. Or boy, I guess. I've already got my uh, own samples in there. I'm gonna test so it out tonight after closing. Men. Uh, how do you get the DNA samples? Isn't that obvious? Saliva, fools! Well, naturally. Oh, of course. Where'd you get the father's sample? Oh, him. Well, I was just in Washington, D.C. for a special occasion, and when I was touring the White House, I met a nice man in a dark suit. He was polite and didn't say much. Seemed like his spit was as good as anybody else's, so I picked him. Okay. See you later, Miss Bosco. We're gonna pick up some swinging 60s chicks and start a groovy hullabaloo. Men. Cut it out, Max. You don't even like girls. Oh, right, right. You got a problem with women? Nah, just never interested. With all the general malice I have to get done in a day, girls are just a huge waste of time. I have never been as turned on as I am right now. Uh, what? You just never found the right woman, and I never found the right man. Forget the baby maker. Catastrophic temporal anomaly detected. Run away with me, Max. My white stallion. Curse my <laughs> irresistible animal magnetism. You should reconsider, you should reconsider that Max isn't into you, Max doesn't even like how this country is over. Miss Bosco, I really think you should reconsider. I can already see us. Living next door to that nice <coughs> detective. Well, it would be nice having someone to do my laundry. Oh, shit. Home. And yet, I always end up <laughs> with so many bloodstained shirts. Tis a mystery. Gonna piss her off even more. Max just isn't that into you. Oh, jeez, Sam, show a little tact. What he means to say is, there is absolutely no way, no how, I would ever, 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 ever be interested in you until savage. the day the Earth is consumed by the flames of our exploding sun. Yeah, you say that wreck. now. Max is psychotic. Max is belligerent, recalcitrant, and quite possibly psychotic. So you're jealous, is that it? Want to keep him all to yourself? I never knew you felt this way, Sam. Temporal anomaly detected. Shut up. It's not like that. Max is no good for you. Max is no good for you. Oh, I can fix him. Max doesn't like girls. Max doesn't even like girls. They're a nuisance at best. Hasn't been interested since. Well, when did that start exactly? I think it all goes back to that time we were. No flashback? Okay. Well, it's been ever since junior high. They haven't gone back to the office yet to see what's inside the door. No, I'll close it. You're wasting your time, Miss Bosco. Max just isn't interested. The more he protests, the more I know he's the one. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Uh, can we scan ourselves? Or is it a sampler of coke? Hmm, it printed out a card with the Intergalactic Freelance Police logo. Sounds intriguingly futuristic. Let's scan Max as well. Max, where, where are you? Scan Max as well. Boom. It printed a time card with Stinky's logo on it. Oh, Stinky. Yeah, I, I don't know about the girl. I think the girl... What's, I'm just Stinky and a girl. But if the girl is actually a Stinky or... Uh, Say she's the granddaughter or whatever. I mean, I presume not, but we'll see. So, what's this one now? What do you think you're doing? You know, the usual traveling through time and stuff. Override. You've caused a catastrophic temporal anomaly. You're going back to the ship so you can think about what you've done. No! What's the thing down there? I wanted to use another one. Oh, it's a Bosco's one. Just look at what you did. Sam, what's a catastrophic temporal paradox? That! What the hell did you guys do? Max, when you made Mama Bosco decide not to have a baby, 
That meant Bosco was never born. Ah. Oh. if Bosco was never born, then we never would have gone back to meet Mama Bosco in the first place. Yep. Neat. And Are you of. fools just going to stand there explaining everything? Or are you going to fix me? Sheesh. Give a guy a cool cow body, and all of a sudden he's the owner of the time stream. Okay. Whee! Uh, we're not going to use that one. I'm probably using Move. more of <laughs> What That's did you me. say? Move! We just use that one then. Look, Sam, more visitors. I don't know how to use a light bulb with that. Oh, we're in the future, then. Why would you look old? Yeah, if you just oh, okay. Since we're in the office, we can check. What's inside here? Whoa! What the? F I okay. hate pack rats. Bulletin board. The bulletin board's all wet and ruined. We must get careless in the stinky future. Stinky stick cares? tight. What? It says stinky stick tight adhesive. Oh, adhesive. Based on an old family recipe, number one throughout the entire galaxy. With secret ingredient vitamin 13. It can't be all that big a secret if it's on the poster. Maybe secrets are different in the future. Can this we take is it? Stinky stick tight mm. adhesive based on an old family recipe with secret ingredient vitamin 13. Okay. With this bad boy, we'll never need another file cabinet. There's no TV here. I don't know, should we be talking to our future self? Yeah. Hey, future Max. Oh, hey guys! Look, Sam, more visitors for your special day! Comically backwards past versions of ourselves! Nah, I want to keep these shoestrings. That's nice, Sam. The future is a baffling potpourri of peculiar sights and rumors. Yes, our advanced world must be frightening and ground. confusing to you. I'll try to speak slowly so that your 21st century brains can understand. Okay. So much in the office has changed. Oh, the wonders I could show the two of you if I wasn't afraid of violating the time stream. Yeah, the time stream's asking for it. Well, okay. In the future, we can make phone calls to other people even when we're not at home. My God! And our cars now have additional brake lights above the rear seats. What about robots? Do we have robot slaves in the future? With lasers? Oh, you uncultivated savages. Robots are used for controlling our spaceships these days. Surely you've heard of the main Tron 28,000 line? Well, of course! Right, Sam? Everybody's heard of that. I can't shoot, Max! You must have been having a ton of exciting future adventures in space. No, oh, we don't take that many cases anymore. We try to stay mostly around this street and the neighboring shops. Still? If you're not taking cases, what do you guys do? I've become an expert in volcanology, and Sam is... <sighs> well, Sam is in his own world now. Great transmogrifying vapor wolves of Rifle 17 <laughs> Booster rocket through the Van Allen belt. I'm in my office. What's wrong with the other me? Oh, he's fine. Mostly. The years add up, though. It's lint from my pocket. This should be useful later. Do you remember how we cured Bosco of his parentage problems? Bosco, Bosco. Oh, he's the guy who invented Skynet, isn't he? No, I was hoping I'd be the one who did that. I don't remember much about that case. Uh, something about spit, wasn't it? I'm glad to see the old freelance police are still in business. Yes, dear stupid past Sam. But of course, now we're a wholly owned subsidiary of Stinky Corp. Stinky Corp. Okay. What's Stinky Corp? <laughs> <laughs> Get a load of this, Sam. These yokels have never heard of Stinky Corp. I don't feel like playing darts right now. Yes. Well, anyway, Stinky Corp is the mega corporation that owns everything in the future. Stinky made enough money from her diner to take over the world? No, no, cretinous Max. 
from her super adhesive. What's this about stinky That's super the thing adhesive? Post the it room revolutionized room. the post whole up. galaxy. Now it's used for everything from scrapbooking to alien spacecraft. She's claimed in interviews that it was based on an old family formula. But Sam and I think we figured out the real secret. It's made from mole men. Okay. Good seeing you. So long. Th that's how we say goodbye in the future. Okay. Let me see if I can kick out the piston. It's now, a so stinky, about it. stick tight adhesive, based on an old family recipe nope, with secret ingredient vitamin 13. Nope. Okay, can't pick it up. Okay. Okay. Uh. I guess we leave. Oh, can we use? Hmm. Max's was thinking, right? So let's use thinking. Let's go. 